Welcome, welcome to this new episode. My name is Michel Network. I'm glad you're here. And today we're speaking about, and I'm reviewing as well, the coin and master coin bit green. And I got a, a lot of messages in the last weeks from my community uh, through Telegram, Instagram, and so forth and so forth. And they told me, Manuele, can you make uh, new reviews about master nodes? Because I'm doing always um, reviews in German. And today we're speaking about Bit Green. And in my opinion, it's a promising project that is based on a proof of stake algorithm and has a really active team behind it. And they are really ambitious. I I, I, I wrote. Um, through uh, Discord with him and we will have as well an interview uh, in the next weeks for sure. They are actually focusing on their ecosystem which includes the stake-based platform, their own exchange and new desktop and web wallet. And if you stay until the end we will have as well a bounty and now let us start this show after this introduction. All right, all right, we are back and now we will have a closer look into Bitgreen and actually they have announced the stake base. It's actually on beta and they will release it on the fourth quarter 2019. And if we scroll down, we see here a little video about, well, the decentralized organization, what they have, or better saying a Bitgreen foundation, what will be opened in Switzerland. And they will focus on teaching people about cryptocurrencies, master nodes, and many things more. And this is what I really, really like about that. And what Bitgreen doesn't really, really like about that is the environment treat, because the Bitcoin network consumes more energy than 82% of countries on Earth. And this is really crazy. And if we scroll down, we, f we see that uh, Bitgreen has a proof of stake algorithm and master nodes for, for sure. They have the combination of fixed block reward and a creation of a fair distribution of coins. Here we see for sure a Bitcoin fork because we have a maximum supply of 21 million Bitgreens. And if we scroll down, we see that we have a 85% of the block reward are getting the master nodes, 10% are getting the proof of stakers or stakers better saying, and 5% goes to the governance. So in order we can vote, and this is a decentralized voting system. What Ccoin, what Dash, Pivx, etc. have. So we see here the coin specs actually, uh, we see here the algorithm is the green protocol. We have uh, proof of stake, a uh, block time every one, uh, well, every minute uh, a block is uh, created and we have here 154 transactions per second and we have a total supply of 21 million bit green and we have a pre-mine of 500,000 which is not so much in my opinion and we need 2,500 bit greens to start a mass node. I will show you this in the next minutes how to start a mass node through our platform and so forth and so forth. It's really really easy in my opinion and one of the reasons because I like bit green is because they have a medium blog. They have their own medium blog and they uh, writing new articles about uh, the progress, about the coin, about the wallet updates and so far and so forth. And we see here actually uh, they will release a new ecosystem or better saying a new wallet. And if we click over here, we see here the new wallet of Bitgreen. It will be released soon. Um, I was in contact with the developer and with the CEO of them. And we see here on the right side, the news. On the left side, we see here the transactions, the ongoing and the outgoing transactions. And it's really, really interesting because we have here a new wallet homepage. Actually, uh, we see here visualize staking rewards. You can see how much staking rewards you got in the last days. And we have here the Roots Network and airdrops. And it's really, really interesting because there are people in the community that are interesting in creating content, etc. And Bitgreen will reward you for that for sure. And we have here airdrops as well. So if we scroll a little bit down and the most important thing is 
of a master node is the decentralized governance and crowdfunding and proposal. So we saw this with Dash, we see this with Polis, with Ccoin, we see this with Pivx and so forth and so forth. The decentralized governance is a really essential thing uh, that normally a master node needs to have uh, because the, the community member can vote on uh, on these proposals and you see here on the left side the community proposal and you can vote yes no or abstain uh, it's really interesting in my opinion okay and before we move to the stats and all that other stuffs uh, if we scroll down we see the third and fourth quarter 2019 that's really really interesting because we see here the stake based beta launch they did this and they start to develop the decentralized crowdfunding protocol and they will update the bitgreen org site and the white paper update it's really really interesting and and we see here on the fourth quarter of 2019 the stake base life this is the uh, practically the exchange that you have the possibility to stake your coins your bit greens and all the other coins that have a pr proof of stake protocol and after that you have the possibility to exchange your coins and we see this here you know, on stake base and we see here exstakebase.com and it's already in beta so we need to wait until we have the possibility here to to trade our coins we see here bitcoin bitgreen bitgreen and bitcoin again these are the pairs for we have uh, bitgreen 4 we have cspn and yeah these are basically the coins that are actually here on the exchange of bitgreen we will see what's happened in the in the next weeks and the next uh, months for sure what they are going to release is the Electrum uh, wallet, the mobile wallet and the decentralized crowdfunding web application and mobile staking for those people uh, who want to stake with their mobile phone. And it's um, really um, a good step, what I think. And, and they will release soon more infos and updates regarding the other use cases, what they are bringing out in the next months. Okay, and now we check the stats from uh, Bitgreen and we see actually the price of the Bitcoin is $9,982 and we have here a monthly income of $18.67. So not a lot, but we see here the price went down to 1,215 uh, Satoshi per coin, so 12 cents. We really touched the bottom. This is the all time low, what we have since one and a half years. It's really crazy, but we see here actually a market capitalization of 1.1 million US dollars and a volume of 9,849 US dollars. What I really like about uh, Bitgreen is that they are listed on six exchanges. They got listed on uh, Crex24 and System Coiners are mid size exchanges. Not bad in my opinion. And it brings more liquidity for sure. And we see here the ROI, we have 74.95%. So we reach our ROI. Um, if we check these stats after 487 days and we have active masters over 2300 and the supply is actually over 9.5 million and the coins locked in master nodes are 5.8 million uh, bit greens so we have here 61.72 percent what's not bad in my opinion the more the better and we need 2500 bit greens to run a master node. what costs 0.03 bitcoins which is 303 dollars in my opinion it's really really cheap it touches um its bottom we see here actually 11 12 cents for for a coin and some clients are asking me if it's uh, intelligent to buy such a note for this cheap price or it's risky actually and if we are watching now the us dollar price in my opinion it's really really undervalued so you can really start a mastodon with over 300 us dollars so it's not so much the, the the risk is not high in my opinion but for sure you need always research do your own research and invest only what you can really afford to lose all right all right so now let's move forward and we see here the bitcoin or bitgreen core team uh dylan rhodes and alec beckman these are the co-founders and i will have uh, with one of these two guys uh, an interview uh, through YouTube on my YouTube channel so if you guys have any questions about Bitgreen so let me know under this video type in your comment or type in your questions and I will ask this to one of these two guys for sure 
All right, right, and so now we move forward and maybe you ask yourself, hey, I want to start a few Bitcoin masternodes or maybe one Bitcoin masternode and what should I do in order to start a masternode? And now I will show you step by step how to start a Bitcoin masternode. We see on the left side I have uh, in total 5,025 Bitcoins and 2,500 are locked. So I have one masternode running and I will start the next masternode now. So we will do this step by step and I show you now what is to do. So first of all, you need to buy the Bitcoin coins on the exchange. You have a few possibilities, well, uh, or a few options, I'm sorry. Uh, the, the first option is, uh, for example, Stacks. We have Crypto Bridge, we have um, System Coin, and so on and so forth. So you buy more than 2,500 coins or Bitcoins on the exchange. You send it on into your wallet. And after that, you see here uh, 2,505 or 2,510 available. And after that, you need to go to Receive. After you clicked here on receive, uh, you type in into this label, for example, masternode one, and you type in here amount 2,500. So you click once on request payment. So this is the address where you need to send this 2,500 um, bit greens. You click here once on copy address, you close this once, and after that you click here once on send, pay to uh, this um, address, the label is masternode one what we saved and we need to send exactly 2500 bit greens uh, if you need to open the coin control it's better in my opinion and after that <clears throat> you click here once on unselect all and you see here 2525 then we click yes and we see we see here and we need to send exactly 2500 bit greens okay after that you click one on send and you see here we are sending actually 2500 coins and you click here once on yes all right so you see type payment to yourself you send yours you have sent yourself more than 2500 coins uh, because the wallet needs to recognize that you have this 2500 coins locked okay after you have done this uh, you click once on tools and it's really important to go to debug console click here once on debug console and we type in here masternode outputs okay okay and after that you see here tx hash and output idx and so now we need to have a hoster in order to start our masternode and now we go to crypto self-made okay so now we are on crypto self-made and you have the possibility here to host your masternodes with a, with a few clicks so actually we uh, closed or minimized better saying the bitgreen uh, wallet and it's really really important after you registered on crypto self that you go here to your avatar you click here once and it's really important to click on notifications you click once on notifications and here it's really really important that you connect your telegram uh, with our bot so in order you can receive uh, the notifications and the config file once you did this uh, so it's really really important that once we go to finance and we need here to buy credits in order to host the masternode. So one credit is valid for uh, the activation for 30 days of a masternode. And so we see here one credit, two credits, five credits, 10, 25, 50, and 100. So the more credits you buy, the less it will cost for you. So if, for example, you buy 100 credits, the masternode hosting will cost you $5.37, which is not bad in my opinion. After you bought these credits, it's really important that we go to masternodes and we scroll down and we see actually if you bought for sure 100 credits, you see here my credits 100. Okay, so uh, after that, you see here the output and the IDX. Uh, so we go back to our wallet, we copy this TX hash and our output IDX is one. So we go to crypto self -made and we type in here the output. This is our output and this is our idx the one right so after that we select the coin we want to host bitgreen so actually i am clicking here once on bitgreen and i click once on submit so we're receiving now uh, the notification in the next minutes in the next hours the config file from our tech guy and uh, so we need to wait a few minutes and i will show you as soon as i get the config file all right a few minutes later i got the config file from our crypto self-made bot so what is to do now 
it's really important that we are going to copy all this config file and we go back to our bitgreen wallet so actually we go here to tools in order we can insert a config file and we go here to open masternode configuration file we click here once and after that we are going to insert the config file what we got from our crypto selfmade bot and after that we are going to save this and we can close it all right then it's really important to restart our wallet in order to start a masternode okay and now you see here that i have locked 5000 coins because we need 2500 bitgreens to start a masternode so i have actually two and they are locked and it's really important now to click on the tab master nodes and as you can see my first master node is enabled and my second master node i need to start it so it's really important that the wallet synchronizes um, up to 100 percent in order we can start this master node okay perfect the wallet synchronized and actually we need to click once here and after that on start alias and they are asking us are you sure you want to start master node mn 842 and we are clicking here on yes and we see here successfully started masternode our masternode is now enabled and we're getting the next well the next reward in the next three days okay that's it thanks for watching this video i hope you like this video so um i told you in the last minutes if you have any questions regarding the bitgreen masternode um type it down under this video we have a comment section and i will ask all uh, these questions to the co-developers and we have now our bounty and you have the possibility here to host your masternode one month for free on crypto self-made what is to do in order to win this one month uh, free hosting on crypto self-made number one you need to like this video number two you need to comment with i want free hosting and number three subscribe to my channel okay now let's go to the conclusion of the bitgreen masternodes in my opinion um, the masternode has um, good fundamentals they have really active developers but it's not a guarantee for sure but you need to know um, that in this market uh, a lot of people are actually panic selling they they don't have the clue they don't have the knowledge about masternodes uh, so it's really important for the investors to buy in cheap and sell it higher and this is the most important thing and we see here we have um, touched the bottom i, I suppose so uh, we have actually over 1200 satoshi so uh, actually it's really cheap about 320 us dollars a master note uh, if we see here the all-time high was over 10 us dollars but i don't expect that it goes so far uh, to 10 us dollars but if um, the coin goes up to 50 cents or maybe one US dollar it will be really really amazing uh, so in my opinion we have the possibility here to buy a uh, Bitcoin masters for 12 cents but as I told you do your own research and invest only what you can afford to lose okay that's it thanks for watching this video guys I hope you liked this video I hope you enjoyed it and if you have any questions let me know uh, I'm here on Instagram, I'm on Facebook, I know I'm on Telegram. Under this video, you'll find all the links. Uh, we have for sure a Masternode group, so uh, you can join our group, our channel. And don't forget to subscribe, don't forget to hit the like button and follow me on Instagram. Okay, that's it. If you have any questions about Crypto Selfbit and Host Your Masternodes, let me know. We have here all the videos in English as well, here the Trading Academy, and we will show you step by step how to start a Masternode. Okay, that's it. I'm out. I wish you the best. Matthew Network here. Happy earnings. Bye bye.